six. 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 Hi everybody, you are listening to 31 Days of Horror, a series of blogs and podcasts where every day for 31 days from October the 1st till October the 31st, you will be taken on a ride through 31 film experiences unlike the typical list of movies that you come to expect from the Halloween season. 31 Days of Horror is officially sponsored by Infernal Imagery. Visit InfernalImagery.com throughout October 2018 and receive 20% off your purchases by using the offer code 31DAYS. Today's tea of the day is... Make America Satanic Again. That's offer code 31DAYS for 20% off at InfernalImagery.com. Live long and prosper. Oh, welcome to day six of um, um, 31 Days, days of horror. horror. 31, 31 Days of Should we do a bit of reverb? Let's, let's play. Ready? Welcome to 31, 31 days, days of Horror, where we review 31 movies over a succession of 31 days. Why? Because we thought it'd be, be fun. Yeah, because, you know, do something different for Halloween. Why yeah, not? that's fantastic. Yeah, yeah I love it. Yeah. Cool. And uh, today uh, is the 6th. Andy's come over again. Thank you very much for coming over. This is Andy Lewin. No problem. Hello. Musician. Hello, everybody. And uh, extraordinaire. Uh, yeah. Stephen Radford, to my right. Human. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> and uh, today we're talking about Invasion of the Body Snatchers. Um, we've, we've, again, this is one of those films that we've talked about before. But yeah, yeah. I, I, I really wanted this movie in here because, again... This generation, I don't think they're really clued in. Um, no, no. So I'd I'm like... I'm quite surprised this hasn't been remade again. Uh, well, Because how many has. times has this been remade? It, it, the most recent was with Daniel Craig and Nicole Kidman was just called um, The Invasion. Oh, I saw that. Was yeah. that a remake of this? That was... Well, it was a remake of, of a remake of, of whatever... Yeah, of yeah, the yeah, concept yeah. of Invasion of the Body Snatchers. What this film has never actually done it is generate sequels. Mm. Which is always about the uh, the uh, the uncovering of or the discovery of the, um, the the pod people, yeah. as we like to call them, yeah. um, the, the the ones who are stealing our bodies and replacing us one by one. Yeah, um, all got a really nice falsetto voice. They do. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! The scream, the, oh, it's the, the iconic Steven. scream. I've I don't I, I didn't know where you were going. It's, it's, these musicians, they have their words. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> so uh, got, I yeah. know because this is yeah. a favorite of yours, isn't it? I, I think so. It's one yeah. of my one of my top ten movies of all time. Yeah, I would say so. How do you feel about this movie? No, I, again, I really like it. Yeah, it's a yeah. really good film. I wouldn't put it in the top ten of one of mine. No, 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 no. But it's one of those films that if I'm flicking the channels and it's on, I'll watch it to the end. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's one of them for me. It's like I could have watched it yesterday. I'm flicking through channels again. No, oh, I'll watch this again. It's just like, yeah. it's great. It's, it's really there. well constructed. It's well, yeah. Film. It kind of reminds me of Alien in that way that you can watch it with the, uh, in the background and do anything and it could just be there and you, it's it's such an accessible movie you can just jump into and out. And, Absolutely, yeah. You, and know. you know where you are. What? You've got Alien on in the background just the, the constant... <laughs> it's great. I'll be terrified. <laughs> I, I swear to God, I, I, I use that uh, as all the time when I'm doing housework because I know I just love the music I just love the sound and with, with this yeah the sound that comes from this is yeah. really boom, boom. it's not really music but it, it's a, it definitely evokes some sort yeah, of yeah so you get that kind of ambient oh yeah and that's Danny Zietlin the, uh, yeah. the extraordinary jazz musician who who was asked to make this you know and, and it is eclectic it is very eclectic and it's very unusual and it's it's all about the, 
it's almost like you're inside a body, you know, listening yeah. to digestive system. It's incredible. Love it. Um, but uh, yeah, so I do have a soft spot for this movie. Yeah. Um, it's got a great cast. Yep. Solid cast. Donald Sutherland. Yeah. Leonard Nimoy. Donald Sutherland's hair. Still a... Uh... Yeah, hanging that, on in the. It was that was when it was actually a character in itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The seventies were all about his hair. Um, Jennifer, Veronica Cartwright was in it. Jeff Goldblum. Oh, of course he's in being it. Jeff Goldblum. Yeah. Doing what Jeff Goldblum does best. Leonard Nimoy's sideburns. <laughs> he's got. Yeah, this was definitely one of those. Uh, I'm not going to do Spock. I'm going to be an emotional guy. That's it. I'm not I'm Spock. Not, I'm not Spock. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh, but um, yeah, they're, they're probably going to have to remake it again uh, because it's it's one of those. Po- it's a very popular story, you know. Well, would you say this is the quintessential one? I think so. Yeah, I'd I, say I so. When when I look at them all, I just think I feel as though this one has the. It's the one that gets under my skin. It's yeah. the one that I That's feel, great. I smell, I taste it. It's yeah. it's got all the set. Oh, sorry. Whoop. Sorry. Getting excited, he's punching the mic. <laughs> I'm punching the mic. The equipment is gonna start shattering everywhere. Um, yeah, this is the movie that really gets me, you know, thinking and, and pumping on all on all on all levels. I love it. Yeah, I think it's because at the very beginning, it's subtle changes with people, isn't it? That you yeah. can't, and it's just, just something not quite right here. Yeah, and I completely forgot to talk about Brooke Adams in that whole list of of people. I mean, she she. Oh, yeah. Uh, literally, she's as she's telling the story, as she's giving the uh, exposition. You know, we're kind of like seeing all the things that she'd seen and the exchanges, and and it kind of, you know, it's just like, um, you know, everybody's kind of moving in different directions, different forms. It's like, like I, I, dance. I, I, it is kind of like, like a, a dance, ballet. but it's 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 just one of those weird alien dances where they're actually not, you know, yeah, the, yeah, it's just well, they're just walking, yeah, and standing and staring, Martian Swan. Yeah, it's fantastic. Martian Swan. I'd love to see that. <laughs> yeah, that'd be great. Invasion of the Body Snatches, the ballet. It was just people standing there, still no dancing. Yeah, the just man. dancing, staring, and ah! <laughs> there is a lot of screaming. That face he pulls when he does that, Donald Sutherland. It's incredible. Yeah, that's it's... one of those. Uh, we used to. Uh, sure. Yeah, I think it does. We When we did Frame by Frame, we used to talk about the best scares were on the end of three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it wasn't on a pulse. It wasn't on a one, two, three, four. You know, one, two, three, skr. It was like one, two, three, skr. Yeah, and this yeah. kind of the scream sort of comes on that offbeat. You know, that kind of it's... when he does it. When he does it, yeah. Do you, yeah. Know, I, you... Do you know what I'm getting at? Definitely, yeah. I mean, you kind of don't know it. It's like in that moment you think, "Is he? Isn't he? Is he? Isn't yeah. he? Isn't he? Is he?" That's the beat that you've yeah. got going because then... you're playing. Is he? Isn't he? Isn't he? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, like, oh it. no, he kind of is. Oh. Not going to spoil it, folks, but you know, if you haven't seen this movie already, then you really should go and see this movie. And uh, I, I, like I said, I had the photo novel, um, and during Frame by Frame, when we reviewed this, we reviewed this on a very sad note. It was when Leonard Nimoy Leonard, passed. Yeah, we just talked about him, didn't we? And... Yeah, but we, I thought there's no way we're ever going to be able to inject our humor into this episode. And we did because we have the photo novel yeah. of Invasion of the Body Snatchers and Andy so graciously, uh, and I might just throw in an excerpt now. Do you remember that funny part where um, Leonard Nimoy goes, that's right, just relax. Now you're going to be all right. You want to go home now? Will you come and see me tomorrow? We'll all talk, the three of us. Okay. Yeah, I do. <laughs> And not referring to the photo novel, I believe that's the scene where. Um... Do you remember that time when he said, "No, I just, just gave her a psychological band aid, Matthew. I should talk to her some more. I could bring her by my office tomorrow around four. What's the matter with her? It's, it's like, like there's some, some kind of hallucinatory flu going around. People seem to get over it in a day or two. All I can do is treat the thing. Somewhere in the outermost limits of space, far beyond man's mindful speculations. A wide expanse of seemingly desolate wasteland issues forth evidence of a determined undertaking. A haze of organic matter deep in the throes of intense labour, changing preparation for departure. <laughs> so there we go. That's uh, that's another day in the life of this 31 days of horror. Um, it's It's been a pleasure again. Yeah, I go and I really recommend watching this film. If you Gotta haven't seen it. it, watch it. It's really see, he likes it more than I thought he did. Yeah. Did you think I didn't like it? No, no, I, I think you did like it, but um, you you really want them to watch it. That's good. I do. I really want them to watch yeah, it. Because just go home and watch it now. Go yeah. and watch it. Watch it. Watch, watch it. it. Not you. No, not, not you. you. Yeah, you. You. That's it. You know who you are. Yeah. 
Yeah, that person there. Yeah, he who's listening? You, you, you who's listening? You know who you are. It's not for you. We can talk about the faculty pumpkin. and how it's essentially the, faculty? the same thing. Oh, really? Have you seen the faculty? No. Frodo's in it. Oh. Elijah Wood. Um, a selection of other people. And it's just a, it's happening in a school and people start getting taken over by aliens, essentially. It's the same thing, and it's called the faculty. Yeah. Robert Rodriguez. Rodriguez. How do you say Robert? Robert Rodriguez. Rodriguez. He yeah. directed it. The faculty. The faculty. It's just a rip-off of the body snatcher type yeah. thing. But that's quite strange that he directed that, because he's well known for doing more... 90s low budget I'm talking 90s yeah, yeah. probably have to look it up but mm -hmm. yeah, essentially so it's the same story yeah. you know of just people getting taken over and yeah you know there's a teacher that's got full of the cold all the time and all of a sudden she's not and she's perfect and she's Selma Hayek yeah. no she's Fam K Jansen but Selma Hayek is in it and um, yeah it's another, you know if you want something to tie along with Invasion of Body Snatchers and the faculty it is it's the inferior and that's okay. No, 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 that's that's not, okay. That's not yeah. It was like a nineties yeah. horror. It was a like teen thing. I think right. it, I think it was in the vein of Scream when Scream came out. A lot of these, you know, teenager movies came out. Yeah, maybe. and they're probably you know saying, "Well, oh, well, they did." When a stranger calls, what should what should we rip off? <laughs> Invasion of Body Snatchers. Yes, that's what it. What doing in a school? Sold. Sold. Yeah. So. <laughs> Sold, kid. <laughs> well, I want to see the money. Yeah, show me the money. <laughs> yeah. No more pod people. No more pod people. I no want, more remakes. I want people in cocoons. <laughs> yeah, cocoons. But I don't want Gutenberg back. Send him away. He's dead to me. <laughs> anyway, see That's you enough. tomorrow. See you tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow, it will be another day, allegedly. No, literally, it will be another day. Bye-bye <laughs> for now. Bye. Now for a word from our sponsor. 31 Days of Horror is officially sponsored by Infernal Imagery. Visit infernalimagery.com throughout October 2018 and receive 20% off your purchases by using the offer code 31DAYS. Today's tea of the day is... Make America Satanic Again. That's offer code 31DAYS for 20% off at infernalimagery.com.